Just look at the size of Bobby Lashley. Truly almighty. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Colorado Springs, Colorado. Weighing in at 273 pounds. The old... Hey, do you guys see that? Bobby yeah, he must have thought this was Bobby. his entrance music. This is completely uncalled for, but completely validated, Cole. And we're getting dangerously close to the referee calling this match off. These superstars need to come to their senses. I hate to say it, but I think that ship sailed. I have no idea how you stop a fight like this now. Counters with an attack on Breaker. Gut buster. Across the shoulder. Filthy. Facing off at the top of the ramp. I don't know what's going to happen, but it's going to hurt. Corey, we've seen the immense success Braun Breaker has already achieved. That has to be a tremendous amount of pressure to maintain this sort of trajectory. Yeah, Cole, I don't envy the kind of pressure Braun Breaker has on his shoulders, but he needs to maintain focus one match at a time. If he does that, he should be successful. Gut buster. Plenty of ways to get creative up on the entrance area. Also plenty of ways to get yourself seriously hurt. Oh, put down face first. And that intensity of bronze got tapered down a bit there. Lashley showing off his superhuman power with that attack. Toss back into the ring. There we go. Superstars finally enter the ring and we are officially underway. Braun Breaker getting the crowd riled up right now. Big forearm. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Crash landing, powerbomb. Crashing down like that, having the wind knocked out of you. Never a good time for that to happen. Braun dodges just in time. Here it comes. Nicely done. He's getting a little batter now. That was just a small sample of breaker inherited ability. Falcon arrow. Breaker wants his opponent to know they're in for it. Hooked up, it looks like for a belly to belly, sent all the way to the outside. And Breaker has taken control. Breaker maintaining focus, not letting the pressure get to him there. Turned that one around. And he needed that badly. Maybe Lashley's found a new source of aggression to battle back with. Yeah. Oh, running STO plants him. Nicely done. Taking this outside. This could be good. Getting back into the ring. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Slam down. Oh, look at this. From the ground up. Power slam. You have to be in peak physical condition to pull off a move with that much weight behind it. Kick to the gut. What are they looking for here? Looks like a pump handle into a power slam. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. Yeah, I think Lashley put all of his might behind that. Oh, and Breaker turns the tables. Shoulder tackle. Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. Working the midsection there. Makes the cover. And he easily stops the ref's count. I didn't think this match was close to over. Ooh, stinging kick. 
What now? Oh, not to the belly! He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. From the top, double axe handle connects. Looking for a scoop slam, no, slips behind. Inverted DDT, the better part of Valor. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. He's back into the ring. Taking it outside the ring now. Man. Headlock, oh, a cheap shot right above the eye. He can end it here. Strong kick out there. I can't believe the ref didn't get two here. Breaker now, getting in position. He's turning the tables. Got to find a way to get out of this. Ooh, right to the throat. Has them up. Nice waist lock takedown. Holding on. How about another? Repeated waist lock takedowns. We're undoubtedly nearing the end. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Piercing the throat. And he saw that coming from Braun. He's taking this to the floor now. Ah, oh, being driven down. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Gut buster. Across the shoulder. Filthy. Ooh, man. Big elbow drop. And he tosses it back in now. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the rest count, Cole. And Braun somehow holding steady late into this matchup. Yeah, Lashley's got to find some way to fight through this. He just won't give up. Oh, took the opening to kick them right in the face. Well scattered reversal there. Boom! This is what he feeds off of. Moments like this, this big match feel. Whatever's plan here can't be good. What now? What now? Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Breaker defiantly getting his shoulder up in time. Lashley's at a loss for words. He doesn't often allow anyone to get up after that. Forearm club. He's been placed in the corner now. Belly to belly. And he barely evades. Oh, clothesline. The pillars of this building must be crumbling from the energy these fans are putting out right now. These superstars are giving it their all, and this audience is giving it right back. Just cranking the head. Oh, look at this. So ruthless. We got a cover. Still in this. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't either. Can this ref even count to three? Dodges out of the way. Lashley is now under pressure. And I bet Braun.
looking to inflict more damage, too. Oh. That's Breaker doing what he does best in steamrolling. He's going to the pin. This could be it. And to the pay window. And he fights it off. How in the world did he... Braun Breaker submission all the old... Breaker looking to force the submission with the Steiner recliner. The official asking him, is he going to attack? And he may have felt his grip slipping, so he releases the hold. Still was able to produce some considerable damage, though. Lashley a step ahead. Feed off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. Looking for a scoop slam, but from behind. Inverted DDT. Measured up, and boom, drop. This is an unwieldy attack from Braun. Bobby's arsenal is being taken away. Oh. Oh, look out. It's on now. Ooh. Nothing pretty here. Just good old-fashioned fisticuffs. Giving up now is not an option. They have to finish this. Toe-to-toe, -to -toe, treating each other like heavy bags. The willpower, the sheer guts of these two. Oh, man. What impressive determination from both competitors. Keeping at each other no matter what. Oh. Back and forth, blow for blow. Just teeing off on them. Oh, one thunderous final blow. Kate the shoulder. Lashley's losing any kind of advantage here. Full focus from Braun. Taking this to the floor. Whoa. Measured up and oh, drop. He fends off the attack. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Check out this display of power by Braun Breaker way overhead. The military press into the power slam. The outlook is bad for Lashley. It's over. Braun Breaker gets it done. Here is your winner, Braun Breaker. Braun Breaker standing victorious in the ring. Braun came here tonight to get the job done, and it looks like he did just that.
The new day, the power of positivity has taken over my hips, my heart, and my entire soul. Come on, guys, clap with me. Sit Dude, down, Saxton. I will not stop, Corey. Day rocks. The following contest is scheduled for one thumb. On the way to the ring, accompanied by Big E, at a combined weight of 417 pounds. Like I look at these guys and I think two things. Boy, do they love unicorns and pancakes too much, but also they can main event any show on their own. And that's why we are oh so lucky to see them here tonight. <laughs> And their opponents, accompanied by Jinder Mahal, at a combined weight of 572 pounds, Veer Mahan and Saga Indus Sheer. Oftentimes with teams, you know one member is better than the other. These are two superstars who are equally high level. Referee signals for the bell, and we are finally underway. These superstars are seeing red right now, gentlemen. Drape upside down in a tree of woe. Oh, Veer counters. A oh, bear hug. The bear hug cinched in. Got to find a way out and catch your breath. Look at this. No quit whatsoever. Ready down elbows and escaping the bear hug. And well-timed maneuver there. Nothing fancy there. Attack to the midsection. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. He's one step ahead there. Oh, the face has been planted. Right to the face. My God. The stop. He could do it here. And he kicks out in two. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Had that one scouted. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. A perfectly placed target. Here he comes off the tag, and he gets the tag. Nice 
Dropped him with a big shoulder tackle. Oh, big is this manager doing looking under the ring? He can't be acting like this. Oh, strikes with the back elbow. And a tag there. One step ahead of Veer there. Cha-ching! Step up in Zaguri. Oh, God, that makes the cover. And the referee stops the count before two. Still no end in sight here. Power slam incoming, no. And Steph delivers the inverted DDT. What are we gonna see here? Oh, a neck breaker. Sent into the corner. Face first. What are we gonna see here? Full head of steam. Uh oh, we got a little fist cross action. Oh, 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 pounce. Reaches his partner for the tag. Answer that with a knee to the gut. Saxton, you and I would never have that kind of chemistry. Hey, I'd be a great teammate. I've seen you trip over your own left foot. No thank you. There's a tag. Oh, golly, devastating teamwork. That was that chemistry you cannot teach. Kofi. Oh, S.O.S. Coming to the rescue. Kofi getting set. Could be one move from victory. Kofi kicks it. Saga's in deep peril here. Trying to end it. Oh, he kicked out. I do not know how they got up from that. Operating on pure instinct and adrenaline right now. And Kofi's starting to become disheartened. He's given everything tonight. Set up in the corner of the ring. He's getting fired up now. Really? Tag made. Tandem offense on the horizon here. Set up for a sidewalk slam. Connecting with the elbow drop. Saga sees the finish line. Look at a battle like this one unfold. Yeah, the WWE Universe clearly realizing just how lucky they are to be watching this match live. And he sends him into the corner. Oh, and a double axe handle. Incredible height. 
Veer keeps him at bay. And didn't see that boot coming. What an overhand chop. Woods finds an opening. Traps the arm into the hammerlock. Into a DDT. And that's the tag to Kofi Kingston. Beautiful athleticism. Oh, DDT. This match is brutality starting to show on him. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Oh, with a fly. Boom. Drawing dangerously close to a count out here. Dominating shoulder tackle. Delivering elbow after elbow. Neither competitor makes it back. We have a double count out. Make way for the It Couple. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Maurice from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz. These two are such a wonderful couple because they have so much in common. Title reigns, reality television success, being beautiful. Here's another thing they have in common, Corey. They won't shut up about it all. Why would you shut up about that? These two even tag together at WrestleMania. It's Ugh. truly a beautiful love story. I wish you'd shut up about it. A one-of-a-kind athlete. Here comes Scripps. And his opponent from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 180 pounds, Scripps! Growing up, Scripps had to fight for all he had. Now he'll fight to get everything he deserves. Well, Scripps says that's just who he is, that it's the only way he knows how to do it.
superstars in the ring, and the referee officially starts the match. Well, if this is the way we're starting, Cole, I think the WWE Universe is in for quite a show tonight. Yikes. Oh, man. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Shoulders down. And he manages to kick out in one. These men knew this match was going to be hard fought. Oh, drop kick. Uh oh, uh oh. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. That's a bad landing. Oh, man. Oh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Tilt the world head scissors. The Miz has proven to be an expert when it comes to cheap tricks and underhanded tactics. How do you counter that? as his opponent. If by underhanded tactics you mean clever strategies, then yes, Miz is an expert. And I think the only way to combat that is by giving him and this match your complete focus. Take your eyes off the A-lister for even one second, he'll find a way to get one over on you. He went right into that turnbuckle. Game and Gary, wow! And Miz now finding himself on the wrong side of momentum. This is the level of focus you have to have when clashing with someone as wily as The Miz. Oh, that could produce a dislocation or at the very least, a pinched nerve. Quick reflex is so important in a match like this. Look, Rick. What are they setting up for here? No doubt looking for the home run. That catch is scripts looking. And that might be the start of the momentum swing Miz needed. Miz isn't allowing that burst of attacks to put an end to him. Blackjack! Oh no, this isn't going to end well. Double stomp to the legs. Section. What are we about to soon? He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Into the barricade. Stomping. Ouch. Looking for the single leg, the foot DDT. The Miz shifting the match to his pace. Impressive offense from the Miz. Oh. Would you stop? Miz never missing a chance to put the spotlight on him. Got single leg takedown of their opponent, and there it is, the figure four leg lock. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot. Look at this, he let it go. Oh, come on, double count out. This one just spiraled out of...
Always imaginative and always impressive. this, Michael. Indy Hartwell made her NXT and main roster debuts by the age of just 23. I had my first match at 16. Where are my flowers? Why does no one talk about me? You guys are biased. Look out! Here comes the history maker. The man. Becky Lynch. I'll tell you what, you cannot understate what Lynch has meant to sports entertainment and to women everywhere. And from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch. She is as tough as they come. Yeah, Becky Lynch has had to overcome countless challenges in her career, both in and out of the ring. You know, she's the first female competitor to hold two world titles at the same time. A submission specialist, an amazing in-ring IQ, and one of the best brawlers in the women's division. Becky Lynch can win in so many different ways. Let's see how the man does it tonight. And now this match has officially begun. I'm not even sure the word official is in their vocabulary at this point. I think you're right, Saxton, and I love it. Ooh. An uppercut. That'll cost some teeth. Looking for a scoop slam, but from behind, inverted DDT. Oh, that hurt to the spine. Picking the spot. Connecting with a sharp elbow. Oh, look at this. How pretty is this? Face buster. Extending their opponent's arm in a big leg drop. A oh, nice hip toss. And an elbow drop to the arm. Punch connects. Becky just mocking her now. Nice springboard drop kick. Cover! Fending off a two count there. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. Ooh. As far as well-rounded superstars go, Indy Hartwell might be the benchmark, Corey. She has the size, the speed, the charisma. She has all that, but she's far too easily distracted by outside factors. While there's no denying Hartwell's many skills, we've seen how easily she can lose focus, and that's what might cost her. How about another? Ooh! Ooh, Becky just aggressively going after that arm. She's fighting back. Hooking their opponent. Flat out power here. Just a stalling vertical suplex. And now showing off a bit. Reversal from Hartwell. Face. Can she do it here? She breaks the count quick. Getting that shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. Carefully measured knee. as the ice 
it. Maybe not. Maybe not. There it is. Becky Lynch is your winner. Here is your winner, Becky Lynch. Well, that came out of nowhere. And an unexpectedly quick end to this match. Clever is really the only word that can describe that victory. However you want to describe it, it certainly worked. Johnny Gargano, Tommaso Ciampa. This is DIY. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 400 pounds. Tommaso Ciampa and Johnny Gargano. DIY. I've been fortunate enough to call many of the wars these two men have fought side by side and against each other. They are a fun team to watch. Two men who have been the heart and soul of NXT. They brought that same passion to the main roster and have quickly become a top team in the WWE. And we're about to see that passion on display. We are about to witness youth and power personified. And their opponents first, representing the Creed Brothers from Lexington, Ohio, weighing in at 285 pounds, Brutus Creed. Few men in WWE can match this guy when it comes to pure wrestling, except maybe his brother. I am looking forward to seeing what this kid can do in the ring. An extremely bright future for Brutus Creed. A true amateur standout, Julius Creed. And representing the Creed Brothers from Lexington, Ohio. Julius Creed is strengths off the charts. He delivers a hailstorm of offense every time he competes. Julius just doesn't care who his opponent is. All Julius Creed wants to do is fight. Finally, all superstars make it to the ring, and we are officially underway. After the way this match started, I can't wait to see where it goes from here. And they were just sent flying on that one. I do not see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be in elite physical condition to pull off something like that. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Oh. Oh. 
Orton. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Double big back body drop. He wasn't tough enough contending with one opponent. Now you got to deal with two. Uses the edge of the knee. High cross body. Goes into the pin. Two count. Oh, he kicked out. Somehow, some way, he must have had that scouted. There's the tag. These two are redefining teamwork. Gut buster. Good no. They finish each other's sentences. They finish each other's moves. That's tag team excellence right there, gentlemen. Oh, ouch. Kick to the gut. Cracked around into a neck breaker. Oh, back elbow. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Gets tagged in. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Uh-oh. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. Clean tag for his partner. Again, an unyielding showing of authority, no two ways about it. Close line in the corner. Uh oh, great wherewithal on the counter, placed into the corner. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. Solely focused on... Ooh. We know that taking out the legs is one of the most effective strategies in any match. We're gonna see it! Gut wrench power bomb! I felt the vibration of that one from all the way over here. And Julius gets met with a response. This superstar mowing their opponent. Look at this from corner to corner. And they're not finished yet. Spine first again. Great flurry of offense from Julius. Johnny's lacking his usual instincts here. Oh, impressive counter. Gargano isn't taking this line down anymore. Instant opportunity for Johnny to turn the tides. Punishing the leg. The legs are a base that you do not want to lose. Chopping down the tree at the base here. Ooh, that's how you dominate your opponent. That is the kind of move that leaves our jaws on the floor. Unbelievable. Tag switching it up. There he goes, right into the corner. Torturous focus on the leg. Ooh. Goes without saying, but a leg injury will hamper your ability to do just about anything. That turns it around for Julius. Belly to belly suplex. This is it. Diggy deep for a kick out. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. Nice side headlock applied. Oh, oh and a right hand for good measure. And Creed did not look great after that. 
You can tell Tommaso was zeroed in on his opponent. Man, knee strike. And he gets set back into the ring. He's returning fire. Getting set up for something in the corner. Waistlock applied in the corner. Check out this power. Belly to belly, way overhead. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. To the top rope now. And tag. He did it. Let's go. Sky high. Tremendous drop kick. Belly to belly suplex. And Julius gets met with a response. Ow! Escapes in a nick of time. right back with a reversal. There it is. Boom. Nice. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. Face meet boot. Golly. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Oh my God! Oh, are you oh my God. kidding me? Back of his neck. He went right into that turnbuckle. Oh, uncorked a big punch. Johnny finding an opening. Stop at the stop. Right on point. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Oh, man, he has fired up now. Caught him right in the jaw. Yeah, what a shot. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Get it, Oh, my goodness. Ah! Smash! That is just insulting. And that's what we call the tree of woe position, folks. Opponent set up in the tree of woe, driving those knees into the abdomen. Tampa just looking to humiliate his opponent. Bad predicament right here. Textbook scoop slam. Put into the corner now. Oh, what's gonna happen here? Look out! Explorer suplex. He's starting to struggle here. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. A uh, tag made, double team coming, heading up to the top rope. What are they up playing here? Doomsday Cannonball. 
That's won it for Julius before. Champ up one step ahead. Oh, God. Measuring. Oh, face stop. He's tagging out. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. I've got to say, the amount of punishment we've seen in the match would have already ended most superstars. The level of resilience we're seeing is off the charts. He's looking shaky at best now. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. In off the tag. Oh, strong impact! It up on their shoulders. Nice Ooh. reverse fireman's drop. Cover! And they're still in this. Looking for more damage here. Release back suplex. Ouch. Back into the ring. Champa. Shoulder block over and over in the corner. And a club to the back. Close fist connects. the 
display of offense we just witnessed there. Oh, and a forearm smash. Stomp to the gut. Foot to the gut. He's been placed in the corner now. Caught him right in the jaw. Oh, what a shot. Sharp punch. There's a tag. Boom, what a punch. Leading the leg, leg breaker. Uh oh, finds the advantage after a string of counters. Oh, God, John Impact. Wrists captured it. That was nasty. Here he goes for the win. Then he closes it out. It's over. It is over. Here are your winners, Tommaso Ciampa and Johnny Gargano. DIY. The Creed brothers weren't able to grab the win in this one. 
Tag team excellence in its purest form. You simply love to see it. And I hope we see these guys tagging again real soon. Here comes trouble. The Judgment Day has arrived. One of the most dominant groups in WWE. The following contest is scheduled for one Making her way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day from Adelaide, Australia, the WWE Women's World Champion, Rhea Ripley! <laughs> the Judgment Day growing more dominant every single night, and their accolades grow with every match. Now, this is a group that's almost impossible to prepare for. The Judgment Day plans for every scenario, always having each other's back. Well, they create chaos. Judgment Day thrives in chaos. Just look at the Judgment Day, powerful, dominant, and ready to unleash their anger. Expect no mercy, no concern for their opponent's well-being. Well, that's how the Judgment Day conducts their business. They want power at any cost. Cora Jade is here. Jando stick in hand, ready for a fight. And from Chicago, Illinois, Cora Jade! As far as Cora is concerned, no one measures up to her. She's on another level. And you know what? I think she might be right. She has a thorny and jealous attitude. That's for certain. And she's always ready to pick a big fight. Get ready to see the toughness of Cora Jade on full display. Well, she showed up with a kendo stick, so we get it. She's tough.
superstars in the ring, and the referee officially starts the match. Well, this is the way we're starting, Cole. I think the WWE Universe is in for quite a show tonight. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Counter upon counter, great minds thinking alike. Oh, wow. Nice hip toss. That's got to be demoralizing. Being thrown around like that by a superstar a fraction of your size? Scooped up and down. What a barrage of stops. Each of those boots seem to get heavier with each blow. Ooh, slam. With authority. What a German suplex. Evades their offense. Both arms captured and vitriolic stops. Golly, an endless trampling there. Ah, oh, look at this. Hair pulled that slam. Taking flight. Body splash. Did you guys feel the rumble from that impact? And that's all she wrote. Cora Jade suffering the loss in this one. Ripley brought her brand of brutality to this match, and it paid off. And this begs the question, who can stop the Eradicator? Behold the intimidating sight of Gunther. The ring general is ready to come out here and do what he does best inside the ring. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, the WWE The ring general has declared the mat sacred and sees this industry as pure sport, meaning there is no room for games and antics. Uh, Gunther takes everything so seriously, like he's always scowling. Hey, listen, he takes pride in what he does. It's difficult not to admire the expertise possessed by Gunther. Gunther is so unflinching, as if nothing phases him. The man's impervious to distraction because he's constantly focused on the task at hand. Yeah, it's like watching a machine. The arrogant social media star is here. And his opponent from Cleveland. There are folks in the crowd, on social media, heck, even backstage, who resent Logan Paul because he's a celebrity who shot to WWE superstardom. Well, some people believe Paul didn't pay his dues and he's an entitled celebrity. You know what? Those people can put in the work to make themselves a star like Logan Paul did. Until then, shut your mouth and immerse yourself in the Logan Paul experience because he's serving it up.
Put your hard hats on. Logan Paul's about to go to work, and someone's about to catch some hands. There we go. Superstars finally enter the ring, and we are officially underway. Ugh. Lights out. DDT connects. Point of the elbow finds the mark. Oh, oh a stop to the belly welly. Well placed kick. Gunther catches him by surprise. Setting up for something here. Targeting the throat there. Knee drop. Uh-oh. He had it scouted. Paul's attack gets reversed. Point of the elbow nailed it. Lining it up. Oh, the jaw getting rattled. Oh, and an elbow caught him and cleared him to the floor. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And so much for ending a match before it starts. Guther got the fight taken to him there. Corey, I can't help but wonder, does Logan Paul even stand a fighting chance here in this one? Well, Cole, anything can happen in WWE. Logan Paul needs to remember every single thing he's learned from his time with top-level superstars like Sami Zayn and The Miz. He had the opportunity to sit under the learning tree of the very best WWE has to offer, and now he needs to use that to his advantage. Tossed into the corner. Ah, oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Getting the upper hand by taking away your opponents. Punishing the leg. Wrestling 101. If you can't stand, you can't fight. Turning the tables there. Foot to the midsection. Has him up for the power slam. Behind you, an inverted DDT. Here's the cover. Oh, my. How in the world did he kick out of that? Just kicking out at one takes a lot in a match like this. Before the one count. He is definitely struggling to keep him down at this point. Ah, oh, kick! Nasty kick. And he cuts bait, slipping out of the ring. Shut up, Saxton. This is just a small regrouping. Goal crushing finale! Oh man, look at that gash on Gunther's face. There's Gunther for the counter. Hoisted up on their shoulders. Death Valley driver. Saw that coming. With the Lariat. Guys, they are getting way too close for comfort here. Yeah, I've seen this before, and it doesn't end well. Mm. Nicely done. Picking up speed off the rope. He's looking a little weary now. That attack was a cacophony of catastrophe from Gunther. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Now that's a bell ringer. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. And this one might be headed ringside. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Ooh, shut elbow. Here he goes for the win. Denying a two count there. He's still in this. Oh my God, it's DDT! Spiked him. Oh, belly stop. Oh. Look at Paul going up top. Where the high frog splash! Is it enough to overcome Gunther? level of fight. 
fight still left, and Gunther. And I get that Paul thought he had him there, but he really needs to follow up. He can't let time cost him this match. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm, has the arm trapped. Goodness gracious. Oh, hold on, is he thinking of a submission here? Dragon sleeper. Clever escape. T.O. plants him. Nicely done. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Logan Paul turning his attention to the... Maybe that will shut him up. Chop block without warning. Elbows right to the knee, round and round. Nothing's gonna stop him. And gets tossed back into the mat. Flying forearm. He is mentally and physically exhausted now. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the gate. The ring general showing off his power. A power bomb. It's all Gunther's for the taking. What a kick out. I don't believe it. I'm not sure if he's foolish or courageous, but Logan Paul keeping himself alive against all odds. It is just unbelievable. And Gunther's tank has got to be running low, guys. I don't know what his game plan is now. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Held in a perilous position. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. Planning on what to do next. Oh, right to the... Really had less than a second to stay alive there. Catches a punch. Wow, springboard attack. For the win. Two. Guys, what a massive upset. One of the biggest we've ever seen. I am shocked that he was able to earn a Oh, my Whoa. God. Dude. Frustration is boiled over. A chorus has broken out for Seth freaking Rollins. Oh, Stop it. Stop oh, it. You almost oh, shut up the entire oh, arena just now. I was having fun, guys. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Davenport, Iowa. Weigh in at 217 pounds. A storied career, Rollins has held every singles and tag team title of note in WWE. The first ever NXT champion, the first man to hold the newly minted
vaunted World Heavyweight Championship. Rollins is one of the most complete competitors this industry has ever seen and is a cornerstone in WWE. You want to prove yourself? Test the visionary. The lights have gone out, heralding the arrival of Bray Wyatt. You can feel the anticipation here as Bray Wyatt commands the WWE Universe. A man who always succeeds in unnerving his opponents. Wyatt concocted for this match. What is he thinking? Referee signals for the bell, and we are finally underway. These superstars are seeing red right now, gentlemen. And here we go now. Elbow drop. Oh, kick right to the back. Take down. Look at the good job getting to the ropes there. Yeah, that could have been bad. Oh, what a counter. Oh, my goodness. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Oh, Bray gets cut off. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Looks like Bray held back on his urges, and it just cost him dearly. Yeah, as Rollins was putting that visionary offensive mindset to work. Swing blade by Rollins. There's a certain unknowable mystique that Bray Wyatt carries with him into the ring. How do you account for that in a physical contest? Well, we've seen Bray caught unawares in the past. He never believes he's in trouble until he is. When that happens, you put your foot on the gas and don't let up. Hoist it up. And he's able to reverse. Great 
strength being shown here. Ooh, nasty shot to the throat. Really just laying it in. Oh, God. Oh, big punch. Ouch. Oh, the elbow connects. Rollins got caught believing his own hype a bit. A destructive blow from Wyatt. Boom! Kick to the face for your troubles. Oh, caught him. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Double underarm hook. Blocked and into a close line. Boom! Will this be enough? No, he kicks out. Doesn't go well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. What are they going to do here? Their opponent is just snapping the neck. Ouch. Momentum's with Bray now. And Rollins in need of salvation. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Out of the ring, what's his plan here? And that has to knock all the wind out of you. Running set time! Check your face after that one. Vicious right forearm. Hoist it up. Gut buster! Rollins in full control here. The revolution knee finds the mark. Ray reverses. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Something inhuman in the soul of Bray Wyatt. It's the only explanation for what you just saw. Rollins is starting to lose his temper. He needs to put that aside and refocus. He thinks he has it. And he only stays down for a one count. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. Oh, using the knee. And he's taking this to the outside now. What are they going to do here? Oh, my God. No, that's too far. Don't come over here. Cole, quick. Use Saxton as a human shield. Whoa. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? <laughs> Setting up neck breaker position. Oh, fall to the back. My oh, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. And now thrown back into the ring. What is he going to do here? And there's the Uranagi. Land of him. Trying to debilitate the capability to stand. So much torque on the knee and ankle. Takes their breath out. Effective counter. Picture perfect drop kick. Just end this now. Oh, he's playing ball. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Insulting. Oh, saw it coming. Got it. Rollins with a head of steam. Big air. The stop. Is it enough to overcome Bray? That was a massive. 
awesome victory for this young man. It was certainly a treat for all of us to watch here tonight. This superstar can now enjoy his victory. Oh, what the hell is he doing? Oh, no, yeah. not the steel chair. Come on. Oh, oh my God. Him. This is absolutely heinous. Totally uncalled for. He's out of control. Oh, look at him, maybe shake hands to start this match. Good sportsmanship here. Yeah, I like to see this. Or, oh, no. I don't like oh, seeing that. that. sportsmanship. This is what I like to see. Let him fight. Well, that's going to fire him up for sure. Hey, maybe they shouldn't have taken the bait, right? I agree with you, Cole. These two can't stand one another. I don't know why anyone thought we'd see otherwise. Well, here we go. And we shouldn't expect a friendly bit of competition between these superstars in this one. Mind games are definitely at play here, gentlemen. Getting into your opponent's head, making them question every step and move they make, that... Uh-oh, submission move. Fujiwara Trying to find a way out. And he's out and delivers a knee. Big, big back body drop. What elevation. Escape just in time. Uh-oh. Headbutt to the gut! Connects on the kick. Solo Sokoa, of course, considers himself the street champ of sports entertainment. Corey, how do you think that self-proclaimed title is going to factor into this one tonight? Cole, being the street champ factors into everything Solo does, both in and out of the ring. That means the power, the dominance, the exp... An early pin attempt. He throws his shoulder up before two. Optimistic thinking on that pin attempt. One arm hooked. Face buster. Dax gets countered. Being carried around with ease. Right across the legs. Drops the leg. Lorenzo just couldn't get out of harm's way there. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. From the top, headbutt. That looks painful. And here's a cover. Pin stopped by rope break. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. <laughs> Saving us from having to sit through that. Oh, jarring back elbow. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Shot to the back. Counters. This could be an opportunity. Uh-oh. A face full of turnbuckle. Uncorked a big punch. Boom. Solo with a timely counter. He is looking to do some serious harm. There's some power behind that punch. Yeah, Up and around, down with a tilt the world backbreaker. Oh my God, what a kick. What is 
the ref doing? Don't worry about that now. Get down and count. Showed her up even before a one count. Truly cannot believe that didn't even get a one count. This one is headed outside, guys. Oh, boom. Oh, man. They do not care who or what they destroy. Yeah, Byron, you are dangerously close to being collateral damage in this one. Down to five. And a double axe handle smash. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Kick connects with a body. And a big knee drop. Is it the finishing touch Stax needs? He manages to kick out. What strength. Wait, are we sure that was not a three count? You can't count that high, Saxton, but that was one of the closest near fall. Winding up. Samoan spike. No way Stax can come back from that. Bloodshed, perhaps worth it now. Here is your winner, Soro Sokoa! And even if they still don't have their opponent's respect after this, at least they have something to celebrate. And you know what? You have to respect this win. They don't have to do anything, Saxton. Yes, but if their point was that they couldn't even lace their boots, I think we just saw how wrong that is tonight.